All right. Hey, everyone. Welcome to the stream. How are y'all doing today? I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. I know I certainly am. Welcome on in, guys. Johnny, Christella, Hamza, Keller, and Heike. Welcome. Hope you guys are having a great day. We are back with another dungeon. All right. Today, guys, uh, today's dungeon is the Drench Blight. It is a hard difficulty ice dungeon. There are a lot of traps, um, quite a few event rooms. It's a pretty, it's a pretty big maze. Uh, loot this week is going to be the tech boots, the scuba mask, the crossbow, and the Mosasaur tech saddle. And the boss this week uh, should be the Cubozoa, the jellyfish. All right, we're going to hop in. Do, do, do. Ben, hello, how's it going? Good morning, Commando. Hope you're doing well today. Okay, luckily it's not too cold. I was worried about that. All right, let's go ahead and run up this way. And first things first, we're going to run over here. My map is in a different spot today. All right, here we go. Carno room, guys. We're going to clear out the Carnos in this room. Trailblazer, hello. I wish that the clicking would stop. They're baby Carnos. They're so cute. Baby Carnos. Um, doo -doo, Nabil, hello. You've been waiting for a video to be uploaded. Well, here we are. Also, I do have some kind of sad news today, guys. For those of you that um, are really invested in the current status of Arc Mobile, a lot of people ask me when the revamp is going to happen. Um, it seems like when they do the revamp, if they do the revamp, um, this version of Arc Mobile is going to be completely retired because they just ended the partner program. Um, so it seems like the game is on its way out. Uh, so that's something. Odds are it'll be a completely new app instead of applying for basically the same title that they have here, which is um, the current Arc Mobile app. It'll be a new one if it is a new one. Uh, that being said, there is no information yet about when or if the revamp will still be coming. Um, but yeah, super sad news. Par partner program is officially over for this game. All right, let's go ahead and grab this. Okay, Ellen, hello. How's it going? Jacob, hello. You just made it in time to watch all my vids of Arc Mobile. Thank you, Jacob. I'm glad you enjoyed them. All right, we're going down the loot run here. Everything is in a different place. One of my uh, monitor screens went out, so I normally have the map pulled up on my third screen, and right now it's like overlapping with my second screen. It's very weird to look to the other side of my setup for the map. So excuse me if I get lost today, guys. It's because I literally don't know where my map is, <laughs> even though I put it there. Da, da, da. <sighs> Right, Commando? Yeah, they should definitely register a new app um, if and when they get around to it, but who knows when that will be, if ever. Sad day. All right, we're running through this. There's no traps in this little loot run here. I'm just kind of building up time, grabbing all the stuff. Yeah, they're definitely going to let this one die. I'm a little sad about it, though, because I loved this version. Although that is true. The people who have this version and have the single player game could continue to use it if they got a new one. So that's something, I guess. That's something. I would be able to continue playing my single player game. But if there's, you know, never any new updates and there's a whole new version, then how many people are going to continue it? Who knows? Uh, Kutusan, hello. How's it going? Hope you're having a great day. Ellen, you love this game. Me too. Me too. I really hope the revamp comes soon because the ending of the, the partner program is like, that's huge. That's through everything else that they've done. That signifies to me the most that it is it is over, you know, like it is this game is officially off the radar for the devs now completely. Um, they will not be touching it ever again, which is really sad. Ellen, your single-player game is so bugged. Why is it bugged? What's it doing? All right, we're in this location. We got a little ice jump to get to these. They're not premium, so, you know, it might not be worth it. 
lots and lots of traps today. Go, go, go. Two loot crates here. Go, go, go. Guys, my, my house is a madhouse. I have five dogs in my house right now, and it's kind of a lot. <laughs> I can hear them barking in the other room. It's terrible. Go, go, go. As long as the new app doesn't overwrite this one. Yeah, I could see that being the case, because I love this version of ARC. Um, unreasonably so, I think, in some cases. I, I'm super attached to it, and I hope that it never changes. So, Other than to update, you know. So, I would be sad if it didn't, if the new one didn't have all the features of this one, is kind of what I'm saying. Um, Nathan says we love you too. <laughs> you guys are awesome. All right, so this is a dodo room, guys. Dodos. Had to search for my map. That was an unreasonably long pause. Where dodo? There, dodo. Charge in swinging. There. Almost. One more. Okay. Three more waves of this. Ellen, no metal and vacato won't respawn, but your base gets all the trees and rocks to spawn in. Yeah. I mean, the game was never perfect. I'll say that. It had issues. It's always had issues. Most games do. But I'm still sad to see it come to an end. You know, the end of an era. I've spent... Gosh, what is it? Like... It's gotta be almost seven years at this point. I think it's been seven years of my life playing Arc Mobile um, and creating content on it. So it's... It's wild to see the journey that it's come on and the entire life cycle of a game like this is, I don't know, something special to be a part of, but also very, very sad to see it end. Not that I'm going to stop. I'm going to continue to play the, uh, play the dungeons every week. I still have plans to do one final, like, current title season before the new one comes out, so we'll see. That may happen sooner rather than later, given the lack of news. Go, go, go. This way? This is the way. It's so hard to look for the traps when I'm, like, this distracted by everything else. All right, facility key is over here. Through an axical trap. Gotta focus. Nope. Nope. Yes. Um, surely the devs know that they need to keep the best features of this version. Don't see why they couldn't. They may not have a choice. Um, the devs of this game had some creative license, clearly. But I don't know with the revamp if that same thing is going to apply. I don't know that they'll be able to have the same sort of creative control that they did over this version, which means it could be a very different game um, if and when they get around to it. Yay. Facility key, guys, uh, in that little square there. Then we gotta go back through. Do, do. Have I seen all the episodes of Ark the Animated Series? No, I haven't seen any. It's on weird platforms. It's hard to get to. Kind of bummed. Um... So I'm waiting for the whole thing to come out, and then I'm going to watch, binge watch all the episodes all at once. And uh, I'll let you guys know my thoughts on it when I get there. i got to keep up with the uh, regular ARC news now, since the mobile news is kind of out. That was risky, but I did it anyway. Um, Alright, let's go down here. There's an ice jump here. So the facility key was there. Everything after the facility key is technically optional. So there's an event room and three loot runs here. We're going to do them because that's how we do in this uh, in this channel. Go, go, go. Complete run throughs. There we go. Running out of time. Latest rumor still June, July. 
Um, the latest anybody heard was a Snail Games update roadmap that had the revamp planned for June of this year. But that's Snail Games. Snail Games is not the developer. Snail Games is the parent company. And companies, um, as I well know, uh, frequently overestimate their ability to get things out on time. Um, so it could be a while before we see the next version. Um, I don't know how long, but I'm hoping still this year. But like I said, that's that's hoping. <laughs> It's not based on any facts or information at all. It's just a a dream. <laughs> um, doo -doo -doo. All right. What was the hardest obstacle I faced out of all the dungeons? Um, there was a Karno room. Before I upped my movement speed, there was a Karno room that was really, really small. And I didn't have enough speed to get away from them. That was really difficult. And then there was one that was um, dark. They released a dungeon that didn't have any light. And none of your artificial light sources would work. Not torches. Not the skins. Nothing. And that was painful because I couldn't see anything. So I think those are probably the two hardest. Was if you're not fast enough. And especially if it's too dark to see the game. Uh, I get really frustrated. Those are kind of my, my kryptonites when it comes to this kind of stuff. Oh, I had to move my capture card. Cord's getting hung up. It's tugging on my hand, and I don't like it. Velociraptor, you love me. Thank you, Velociraptor. You guys are the best. I still have the best community, that's for sure. All right, we're going this way. It's so hard to remember to check the map. Um, I'm going to grab... I'm going to grab these loot crates first because there's no traps. And then we're going to do the optional event room. Once I get my stamina back. Uh, Ellen, your server is up for renew in June. You'll renew one more year if you can. Hopefully they'll refund if it, if it goes away. I would imagine that Natrata would have to refund it if the game is discontinued. But that being said... Um... I, I don't know that the servers are being discontinued because that has not been the case so far. Um, my sponsored server is going to go away, but I should have the ability to renew that on my own if I should so choose. And I have not yet decided what to do about that. Um, you hope it plays on this janky tablet because you're too cheap to buy a new one. Ben, I'm with you. I'm with you. I I like having a fairly up-to-date phone. So, like, I'll always get, like, the newest model of phone when I get a new phone. But I, it takes me years to get a new one once I've got one. Like, I will keep the same phone for, like, five or six years. And then I'll bounce to the newest model, typically. That's how we do. You hate that room where they throw poop on your chalet. Yes, yes. The chally rooms are difficult. Arc Mobile's anniversary is June, so there's still hope revamp may be launched in June. Trailblazer, it's a faint hope. Um, if the devs haven't said anything and there's two months to go and they've not released a beta that they've offered us to sign up for, which is what they did for the first one, they haven't done any sort of testing, they're still clearly working on Arc 2 and... Um, the ARC revamp, ARC Survival Ascended. I highly doubt we're going to get it in June. I have 95% confidence that it won't launch in June this year. It would be nice if it hit the anniversary, but it's not likely. All right, there's a wall trap in this location, guys, so do be careful. The first one. Okay, single tap wall trap, it looks like. There we go. Spikes. All right, I'm going to throw up a quick save because it's been a minute and we're almost halfway through the dungeon, guys. Bear with me. Just going to do this. Manual save, then leave the arc. How do you get snake plant seeds? Jacob, uh, you can purchase them from the in-game store. 
Here we go. Boss after we want revamp. I know. <laughs> Is Arc Mobile revamp on Twitter run by Snail or Grove Street? You'll post on Discord. Um, no, the Arc Mobile revamp is a news, um, a news account. They, they have released a lot of news and got kind of a big following for keeping on top of news for, uh, Survival Ascended and Arc 2. Um, so they're, they actually recently posted something about the revamp coming out in June, which is incorrect. That's just the last news we had. Um, and then... <laughs> Literally, when they ended the partner program, they said they still didn't have any news on a revamp. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> yesterday, as of yesterday, there's still no news from the devs about the revamp. All right, so this is uh, Mesopithecus Gigantopithecus Minions. There's a big monkey. There's a little monkey, and then a lot of big monkeys. And I don't... I hate these. These. I want the little guy. No, give me the little guy. This is awful. This is not working. Face plant with him. I'm gonna get beat up in this room because I'm just not paying attention. I'm struggling. I can't find the little guy. There he is. I think we was about halfway. I'm very hurt. Ha! Works both ways. He tried to torpor me and I was too close for it to work. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Now we kill the Gigantopithecus and then I take some health brews. I'm letting myself get a little beat up in this one. That was a messy way to handle that. Um, Commander says, oh, so that's just a fan spreading rumors? Nice. I mean, it, they reposted the most recent info, which is all that they can do. I wouldn't say that they're spreading rumors. They posted um, a fact that was released from a Snail Games thing, like, many, many months ago, like, last year. Which is the latest update we had on the revamp. The latest official update from any of the parent companies. But, um, and they're also not in the partner program. So they wouldn't know that the devs have not had any word or have said outright that they don't have any word because clearly they've not released anything. All right, there's a premium chest beyond this. Here we go. We're gonna go for the premium. Go, go, go. That doesn't hear yet. Weird. Uh, ben, that's probably because I'm streaming at odd times now with my new job. I've not been able to control my Tuesday morning schedule as easily, so uh, the streams have been bouncing a little. They're still Tuesday mornings, but they're kind of like whenever I can get to them. There we go. All right, and that is it for this part of the dungeon. Let's head up to the starting area again. You mean the account is following the Iguana game, so it must be legit. I wish that's how it worked. Where's that wall trap? It's down here. Spikes. Ow. Trying not to get punctured by spikes. Trying to make it through the wall trap. I'm gonna have to have a lot of medical brews today. Where, which way am I going? Yes, this way. Correct. I legitimately almost turned around there because I cannot keep track of where I've been. It's very hard for me. All right. Gotta go through this. So many traps. It's a good week to do if you want to do traps. Oh yeah, my armor took a pounding from those monkeys. It is a hard difficulty this week. This was always making you nervous. Same. 
You never know when they're going to go off. Ugh. This is just cords, please. Okay. Such a pain. Last time you did that while you died, it's just unpredictable whether it's safe to run or not. No, no, they have a pattern. They always have a pattern. Jacob. Um, it can be hard. You might have to stand there for a minute and watch it to figure out the pattern. But there are definitely safe times to run, and especially if you have the right movement speed. Um, they're, they're extremely predictable. I haven't died to a wall trap unless I didn't see it in ages. Sometimes I've just run through them because I forget they're there. That's when I have trouble. All right, so this is the starting room. We've done officially like a third of the dungeon. Um, gonna run down here and we're gonna grab this loot crate. There is an icicle trap. It's not even a good loot crate. I don't know what I'm doing there. Why did I do that? I don't need equipment for this. I just need to not be stupid. There we go. Nope. There we go. There we go. That'll work. Okay. Uh, Shamshed, hello. How's it going? Wall trap. Oh my gosh. I'm so bad at this. It's not even a premium chest. I don't know why I'm bothering. Two tap wall trap. Nice. Yay, loot crate. I'm going to go through it anyway because I probably have time. All right. And then this. All right, there we go. Whew. Did that. So many traps. All right, another one. Um, let's go ahead and eat first. The other dogs are so noisy. Uh, Mendo, hello. You're new. Welcome on in. Hope you're having a great day. Fence is your completionist. Siggy, that's why you're bothering. It's true. It's a problem. Uh, Cycling, hello, how's it going? Hope you're having a great day. All right, I'm like checking my map, make sure I'm not being stupid about this. Yes, Axical, Loot Crate, then the Facility Gate. Got it. I can do this. These take so long. I hate the Axical Traps. More because they're lengthy than because they're deadly, although they are also that. At least the way that I do them, it's a little slow. But I'm not very good at doing them any other way, so... Yeah. Yay. Okay. Can't see a gosh darn thing. There we go. Loot crate. Pearls, yay. All right, no traps here. No traps here. Pelagornis. Facility gate. Woo! Yay. Finally. Okay. There's also loot crate here. No traps. There's so many traps, I have to check the map all the time. And it's in a weird spot. I hate it. Everything's off today. The vibe is weird. All right. It's just terrible. Okay, we're going to go ahead and grab this loot crate. Also not a very good loot crate, but, you know. We do what we do. I'm, like, running out of water. Enough. I 
I'm taking some big risks today. I really shouldn't. <laughs> it's not wise. I'm not being as careful as I should be with those. I am going to hit a quick manual save just in case I crash. Because you never know anymore if that's going to happen. I apologize, chat. I will read out comments in a second. I'll take a quick pause after this. Make sure I didn't miss too much. Ah, go focus. No dying, only focusing. There we go. All right, we did that. Um, now we have some axical... We have a jump, and then a copy room, and then a couple more axical traps before we get to the last little section here. What's, what's my shotgun damage? What difficulty am I playing? I play on medium difficulty for this game. Uh, my shotgun damage is, I believe, 309, which is decent for this difficulty, honestly. It's hard to find better ones. <laughs> Finally uh, managed to get in here in time to catch you live. Well, congrats, and thank you for making it in. It is always a great day with Ark, it's true. Use rare flowers for food when you go to dungeons. They're surprisingly filling. Yeah, they do pretty good. Um, especially on these games since they don't have uh, the effect that they do on PC. Where they make everything mad at you. Came for the food. My food is full. All right. And then I need to do this. Why is there green smoke? Feels weird. Feels like I'm about to be poisoned. Up. Down. Okay. <sighs> so much effort. Okay. Um, now we have compy room. Compy. Wait, am I too soon? I'm too soon. It's over here. This is the compy room. Copies. Just remember to save. I need to do that very soon. I'll probably do that before the next round. They're big copies. I love that if I crash now, I'm going to end up in the middle of the copy room being eaten. I saw that manual save pop up. I saw the auto save pop up. Not the ideal spot. There are so many copies. Might be better off with a sword, honestly. I might just go stand in the corner. It should be one more wave. This way they have to come at me a limited number at a time, because they, they're they big. Loving Chief Hello, how's it going? False alarm. Ah! Uh, to the Mundo, you've lost your tap gyro when you're trying to tame a Giga. Oh no! That'll happen, Gigas are tough to tame. They're tricky. They're very annoying to tame as well. Woo! That was a lot of compies. Oh, uh, they didn't do much. They mostly just got in the way. Alright, let's grab this loot crate. Pelagornis, please. Uh, Alright, and then I'm going to throw up a quick save before we head into these, because we've got two of these and then more event rooms, so it's going to be, it's going to get busy. You'll see me do a manual save, but you won't see me leave the arc and then back up my save on the manage save data screen, but I'll describe it to you. Imagine if you could bring an ascended pet in the dungeon, that would be nice. 
That would be nice. Although I'm kind of okay with not having a lot of dinosaurs in the dungeon. I think it's all right. I think it makes a weird sort of sense. I think I like it better because it's easier to get gear than it is to get good tames through breeding. Which is one of the reasons I prefer dungeons over the standard boss fights. Also, they're more skill-based. Like, you have to actually pay attention to your character stats and pay attention to your gear and try to actually be good at moving and stuff. I don't know. More skill than just stand and chomp, you know what I mean? Although it is a little sad because it's like, what's the point of taming a Rex if you don't get to use it to chomp? Rex's whole life is chomp. There we go. Okay, not this room, but this room. There we go. We're on the final stage. It's the last four event rooms and little loot runs. Um, that's what they are. Two of those rooms are optional. This one is not. This is required. This is Dire Bear and Dire Wolf with half armor. You know, where's my frying? There it is. Just gonna do a little. There's the bear. Ah. Ow. Knock the wolves out. Because if they all hit you, it'll hurt, and the wolves are fast enough to catch you. Werewolf. They're wolf. Ignore you. Ow. Try to stay away from the bears. Try to run. Lead the bears. Ugh. Smack him in the face. Ah. I almost got ya. Reload. Kill wolf. Probably could do this without all the extra. I probably could just shoot him, but... Eh. Wolves. Wolves, wolves, wolves. Saves me a little bit of trouble and probably a couple of damage bites. Charging bear. There we go. Imagine those eerie gigas. Now that would be amazing. They have eerie gigas. Often during events. There we go. There we go. Threat's been cleared. Beautiful. All right. So, um, first things first, let's grab this loot crate. Then we're going to go do an optional room, which is a growing Araneo threat. No more traps. Yay. No more traps. Just event rooms. Actually, there's one more trap. I lied. There is one more axical trap. Growing Araneo threat. But it does guard a premium, so it's worth it. Spider. Next spider. Don't you dare spawn behind me. You spawn behind me. There was, like, no room, and he spawned behind me. Run over here to the corner. Don't sneak up on me. One more. Big boy. There we 
There we go. He's too big. He couldn't hit me. Beautiful. All right, now we collect our little loot for doing the, the spiders. Shawan. That is not the premium. This is also not the premium, but I'm glad it's a thing. Ascendant Wind Club. Yeah, definitely not premium. All right, and then this one up here is premium. Here we go. We got this. Armor stand. Not that I needed it. Beautiful. Uh, where are the ARC servers? You're poor playing single player. It's your heel. Um, unfortunately, official servers have all been shut down. If you are interested in joining private servers, well, the official servers haven't been shut down. They're just not being supported anymore. So they're full of hackers. Um, there are unofficial servers that are still up and running that have pretty great player bases. Um, you will run into hackers almost everywhere you go, unfortunately. So keep that in mind as you're playing, I guess. All right, so here we go on the bottom. So we have a jump. This is uh, <clears throat> where the featured loot is. I'm starting to lose my voice. It started to go. I'm not doing that. I will not have it. Up. Down. Swirly. It should be a terror bird room. Menender, hello. How's it going? Just a question. Do you have raptors reduce breeding intervals? No. They reduce egg laying intervals, but not breeding intervals. Big birds. Giant shiny terror birds. Uh, Death Devil 2, hello. <laughs> You're still playing the game. I am. I love this game. It's, uh, it's gonna take more than... They're gonna have to remove the game from my phone before I'll stop playing it. They're gonna forcibly have to take it off my phone for me. And remove my access to it. For me to stop playing, <laughs> to be honest. I like the game too much. Um, alright, no... No real traps here. I am weighed down with meat, though, from all of the stuff I have killed. I wish there was a drop all of one type button. That would be nice. Or like a multi-select. That still has never been a thing. It was requested many, many times. But I am weighed down with the meat, so it's got to go. There we go. Feel better. Okay. Okay. Now I can move. Now I'm the proper speed. Grab this. Mind wipe tonic. Don't need. All right, now we're going to grab the featured loot, which is right here. Featured. Yay, primitive tech scuba mask. Delightful. All right, one more bonus crate that is not good, but it's fine. I always end up throwing all this stuff away anyway. But I am a completionist. When will the ARC mobile revamp come? Please do reply. Siraj, we do not know. Um, there has been no official word from the developers yet on when or even if uh, ARC mobile revamp will be a thing. So I wish I had better news for you. Um, the last we heard was June, but that was not released by the developers. That was released by the parent company, Snail Games, which inevitably the parent companies do not have accurate timelines. They always, um, think they're going to get out more than they do. Pretty common with big companies, particularly big, uh, parent corporations like that. There we go. All right, so we have one more loot crate, and then we have one more event room. We have uh, pretty much almost done it. Grab this. Hemostatic serum. That's nice. I am going to sip one of my medical brews. I've had to sip quite a few. 
It actually was a hard difficulty dungeon. Oh, just search me. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember. It's been a long time since I've had to do that. <laughs> a really long time. All right, final event room, guys. This is the Packy Rhino and Trike minion room. So we got to look for the Packy Rhino. And then we're on to the boss fight, which is the jellyfish. So it should not be bad. Where's the Packy? There we go. Well, that was easy. Ah! I'm gonna shoot him in the foot. Ow, I'm stunned. I do not want to go in the corner. You guys are mean. Yeah. I got it. They're so pushy. Alright, that's that. We're at the boss teleporter. Whee. My armor's about half gone, but that is fine. Because we need flippers for this part. I also need to make sure my food is full. There we go. Um, I also need to start the weekly pursuit, weekly dungeon. Sweet, sweet. And get my bow out. All right, guys, I'm going to throw up a quick save. Just in case I get something else. Or die to ridiculous reasons. Hasn't happened in a while on a boss fight, but you never know. Today might be the day that the game doesn't agree with me. Do -do -do. Difficulty? I'm on medium difficulty. The dungeon is a hard difficulty dungeon. Yep, we got the jellyfish. Darn. One of these days, it'll be the Noctis. Not for 20 years, but uh, you're a little too close. No, that's bad. Oh, please let me get away. There we go. I got shocked. What was I saying about this not being my day? Ah. Am I excited about the Ark revamp Siraj? Yes, if it ever eventually comes, I'm very excited for a revamp of Ark Mobile. I, I love this game. I can't wait to see what happens to it. I'm excited for fresh content. I'm excited for more maps. That would be lovely. Um, there we go. Minya. I missed. No, I didn't. I don't know how that hit so late, but it did. Nope, I'm gonna move. Perfect. Yay! Main boss gone. Little boss is starting to split. I like it when there's just a big cloud to toss arrows into. I forget how many times they split. It's a lot. Whoa. They did a thing. Uh, I hate when they go all over. Oh, did that one die die? I think it did. No! Oh. They're so quick. Forgot how fast they are. I don't trust this little guy. Or that little guy. Or here. They're all over! This is not good. There's one. I'll swim through and hope I don't get shocked. They're not being very organized for me today. It's such a bummer. There we go. Oh, 
I think that one did not split, which is good. That means I'm getting close. Quit doing the thing where you dance around and go all over. It's very hard to aim at one of you. I missed. I hate when that happens. The worst thing is when they just decide to suddenly stop aggroing and they scatter. And then they're actually very hard to chase down. I'm gonna die of starvation in here. Some of them are still splitting. Ah. Yay, one down. Woo! We're going. We're getting there. Don't do it. You're doing it. You're doing the thing. at me, bro. Oh, yay. Face plant. Missed. Yes, there we go. Genuinely terrifying. All right. We did it. I can do it. I can spawn at the correct bed. There we go. Are the regular scuba slippers a good free alternative to the frog feet for this boss? Um, yes, they are. They That's what I'm using, um, actually, is regular scuba slippers. I rarely, I think almost never use frog feet for this boss anymore. Because it's just unnecessary. You don't need to. It's a waste of a premium. There we go. Much better. All right, guys. Um... There we go. That was this week's dungeon. Uh, you do get two times the element for it, just FYI. Uh, you, there's a couple of premiums. As you can see, I got like four or five premiums. So it's a decent, decent dungeon this week. It takes a while, especially if you want to do everything. There are a lot of traps um, in the same, the normal number of event rooms, but it's a fun one. All right, guys. Uh, Andrasorio, no, I do not play with a controller. I play just on my phone screen. Uh, there's not good controller support for Arc Mobile, unfortunately. All right, guys. Thank you all so much for watching and hanging out. That is going to do it for today's dungeon stream, guys. Um, yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to hit the like button on your way out, guys. It seriously does help me out. And if you want to see more content like this, you can, of course, subscribe. And I am going to go ahead and catch you all in the next one. Signing off, this is the Iguana.